Alright guys, welcome back to Let's Play Devil May Cry 3, this is Mission 2, The Blood Link. Now, I, uh, re I replay Mission 1 so I get my uh, controlling back into use of this game. So, uh, this is going to be a pretty short set. Um, yeah, let's get to it. It's totally wrecked my shop, and I haven't even named it yet. You're gonna pay for that. Time to kick some ass. Uh, special moves. Let's see here. Uh, input certain commands to execute powerful special moves. High time. Bust enemy into the air. Hold R1 and press triangle while holding the left stick back. Hold down triangle and raise your character. Uh, your character will rise into the air as well. Uh, it's a pretty staple building, Devil May Cry. <laughs> 99 special. I love that. <laughs> um, when it says back, by the way, it's you have to push the joystick away from your targeted character. Your targeted opponent. So, yeah. Whoop! Love you! Grab that! Dash out of the way! Nope! Fuck all of you! Boop 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 boop! Boop! Aw, oh, get into it! Aw, oh, you little dick, you ruined my combo! There they are! Hiya! You! Woo, woo, woo! Love it! Mm. Whoa, boom! Oh shit, what the hell happened? Something ruined my combo! Damn it! Thank you! Come on, there we go. Anything else? Aw, oh, you! There we go! Okay, escape! Dre uh, deftly uh, evade enemies' incoming attacks. Side roll, hold down R1 and press X while holding left and right on the analog stick to s just sort of roll out of the way. And jump backwards, hold R1 and press X while we're doing backwards and you're doing the back there. Where are the enemies? Dash! Dash! Turn! There we go. I'm looking for. There he is. Jump. Whoop. Ha ha ha. Ha ha that was going to be really cool if I could pull that off. Fuck you. Whoop. I got him. Got him. Oh, I couldn't do it. It's one of the abilities of the trickster where you can actually ride enemies. It's really cool. There we go! Woo! <laughs> Come on, let's get rid of this fucker. Mother Stop it! Alright, time for our first boss fight, the Hell Vanguard. He's a bitch when you first uh, play this game. Nope. 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 Dash. Fuck. Break through. Dash. Oh. Oh fuck. Do his dash thing. Nope. Nope. 
Dash. Get away. Come on. Nope. Fuck you. And he's dead. It's been nearly a year since we last met. Where does the time go? No doubt, you've got some fun planned for me. Right, Virgil? Alright, let's see how horrible I did in this one. I got, I got a lot of damage in this one, I know that much. Oh, C. Eh, B's not that bad, really. Alright, let's do a quick save. Alrighty then. Next mission. I'm not gonna start it out, so I'm gonna load up this part for ya. I come well. Doesn't it excite you? The Timinagru has revived. The Great One who once ruled this earth as the medium between the human world and the demon world. Isn't it a magnificent view? The greatest minds of their time, those who revered evil, constructed this glorious edifice. Now, after two millenniums of confinement, it can at last fulfill the purpose for which it was intended. That's none of my concern. Did he have it? Of course. He's taking good care of it. After all, it is the only memento left from the mother you both lost. But he has no idea of its true power. Goddamn, Virgil's such a badass. And in case you haven't noticed yet, yes, at the beginning of each new mission, there is something in the background that tells you which mission number it is. 
Uh, mission one was a, a giant one on the pizza box. Two was on a billboard for mission two, and three was the fiery corpse of those uh, three enemies. Yeah. Anyway, uh, since this was actually a pretty short set, um, I'm not going to continue mission to th into mission three, but I will um, give you my recommendations on how to level up Dante at the very beginning of the game. <clears throat> my first high recommendation is get air hike as soon as possible. Um, this may seem like a pretty eh ability to have early in the game, um, especially considering there's not really much you can use it for even after you get it, because there's not really many things that are out of your reach with air hike, uh, without air hike. Uh, so it's kind of up to you if you want to get this or not, but I highly recommend getting this first. Uh, the reason why is whenever you buy something new, it will uh, everything else gets uh, more expensive. So I recommend getting this at the beginning of the game. I'm actually probably going to redo Mission 1 and 2 and talk and buy this. Anyway, uh, that's it for Mission 3, really. Um, afterwards, with that, by the way, uh, just start upgrading your gear and whatnot. Or master your abilities, there we go. Uh, Stinger and Drive are pretty good for a Rebellion. Anyway, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed Mission 2. I apologize for it being very short. Mission 3 and onwards is probably going to be pretty long. Uh, we'll start getting into more, uh, more interesting things. Anyway. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye! Hello, and thank you for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, please feel free to like and subscribe. If you enjoyed this Let's Play, feel free to click one of the two links to take you to a new Let's Play. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye!